Um, I'm calling, I, I'm, me and my friend are making a documentary film on inventors and innovators, and we were calling some folks up just to see if you, could, if you might have some time to chat. I know what they do. I know what he says. Nobody got it. At the first, there was like, what is that? But I'm basically trying to make a giant toy rocket that I can launch straight up 35 miles and come down by parachute. And to me, that's nothing, that's no big deal. It was a real dream in the night. Um, we didn't realize what we were really getting into. You'll probably do about anything to sell it. I probably would have dressed in a clown uniform and juggled. It's like being a rock star. It's like I invented a product on my breast friend, my breast friend nursing pillow. And I laid it down on the counter and I said, my sister and I invented this. Every couple of days I have some kind of ideas about something. Straight to Cheyenne. And so I, I had no idea what I was going to do with myself. It's the biggest bicycle product in history. Oh! And the cup just slipped through the napkin and the lid came off and fell on my lap. It's a lot of this. So now I burned out the oven, cracked the floor. <laughs> Chuck is not happy. You should never be afraid of failure. You do things your way, I do things my way. Better move, no brakes. And also, when they're coming in to land, they come in and they glide in. What was it like to go through the process? Exciting. Fun. <laughs> Why do you have a video camera? What is this that everybody's watching? But anyway, so I think one reason that people don't dream as much anymore is I think a lot of people have forgotten how to dream. What is your big idea? So anyway, um, that's kind of how you do it.